Alright, so here's your Dometic refrigerator. It is dual fueled, so you'll be able to operate it on propane and electric. Or no, just electric, I'm sorry. So you just hold your button down, it'll turn on. You can have performance, silence, and eco. So you get to pick, and then you can also pick your temperature as well. And then when you shut your uh, door while you're traveling, it stays locked in place so your food doesn't come flying out on you and come into a whole mess. Right in here is our bathroom. It's a small little bathroom, but it works. It does its job. So you got your toilet here. It is a foot pedal. Somewhere, right there. So you just hold that foot pedal down and all the stuff goes down into the black tank. You do have a towel rack here. You got your shower here. And then you also have a skylight. So you tall people still shower. And then you just shut your door like that. Um, down here is your furnace. So this is where your furnace is going to come out, all the heat. It isn't ducted throughout the trailer, so this is where it's going to come out all the time. And then it'll circulate through the trailer. And to be able to access that storage compartment underneath this bunk, instead of having to walk outside, say a training or something, you just want to grab something, you can push this net down and be able to reach what you need. And you also have your top bunk here. And the bunks do have USB ports so the children or friends can charge their uh, tablets or phones. This here is our uh, AC and furnace. So this is just your thermostat. So you just push this power button until you get where you want to go. And then you have your buttons here to do the temperature. And then you also have this fan here so if it gets too hot you can raise it up. Or if you have steam coming off your food you want to get the smoke out just lift this up and turn your fan on so you do have one of these in the living area and you also have one of these in the restroom please make sure you put your vent right hook down so that way when it rains you don't flood your unit this here is our sofa the sofa also has the table so this is also your table it'll attach here and you'll be able to eat your food to detach this, you'll just twist this off and it'll pull up. So that way you don't have this thing sitting in your way. And also this turns out into a bed. So you'll just grab these handles here and, pick, and pull it out. <coughs> it's a trifle. So it does come all the way out. So just be sure when this person get ready to go to bed that there you're done too because it's a tight squeeze between to get to the restroom and then back here this is where they like to store the table so you put your table in here you put your leg in here or you can do whatever you want and put whatever you want in there but there is a nice little storage behind the couch and then you just push your bed right back on in and then you do have your rollover bed here. We call it a rollover because the person in the back will have to roll over the person in the front to get out. So you don't have a whole lot of privacy, but if you need some privacy, you don't want someone looking at you while you sleep, you just pull your curtain this way and you have your privacy. And also be careful, make sure it doesn't get stuck behind the slide out when you run your slide out without. So here on your emergency window, this is the tab you're going to pull to pull this screen off. And then you're going to push this lever and push that door open, window open. So you just push it open and you jump out. And then you can also open it up for fresh air. You do have all this nice storage above the bed. So you'll be able to store stuff in there as well. Now, if you have something in the front storage compartment that you would like to get to, but a training outside and you don't want to get messy, open this one up and you can crawl through there or send the kid in. And you do have 110 plugs here and USB ports and they gave you a basket to put your phone in so that way you're not searching for it throughout the night or in the morning. <laughs>